Hey beautiful. So today I want to talk about one of the things that comes up a lot when it comes to confidence to sell high ticket coaching offers. And that is, you know, how can I be confident? And I've talked about this before, but I was going to drill down a little deeper today. So the one thing that you need to be confident, you know, it's not when I lose 20 pounds or hundred pounds, I'm going to be more confident. You know, when I make a hundred thousand dollars a month, then I'm going to be more confident. Or when I buy red bottom shoes, then I can be confident. None of that makes you confident. When you lose weight, all it is that you're skinny, that's it. When you make more money, it just means you've made more money. When you wear red bottom shoes, you just wear expensive shoes. It doesn't make you confident. So the thing that makes you confident when you're selling high ticket offers and anywhere else in life is to train your brain to trust you, okay? That's it. The reason why you're not confident is because you don't feel an integrity with yourself and your brain is telling you, you can't trust yourself. So you show up insecure with imposter syndrome and everything else. So here, here's how you train your brain to trust you. The first thing you do is you keep your promises to yourself. Okay. The second thing you do is to take care of yourself, self-care. The third thing you do is to act your way into confidence. Act your way into confidence. So don't fake it till you make it. That doesn't work. It's fake. Just choose to be confident. You know, there are times where I've been the only black woman in the room or the only woman on the block. And I've had to be confident because if I wasn't, it wouldn't work. I had no choice. So choose it, okay? The fourth thing you have to do is create a mindset around failure that teaches you to move on. That no matter what happens, it's okay. Failure is not fatal. So create a system, a way of thinking that allows you to know you can always get back up. Because once you have that, it doesn't matter how many no's you get. It doesn't matter who says yes or no or whatever to you. It doesn't matter if you lose weight, gain weight, if you are naked, clothed, whatever it is, you're always going to be confident. And showing up confident on your calls doesn't mean getting a yes. It just means you're still in the game. That's all it means. So if this resonates with you, then my name is Mimi Dabo. Hit subscribe and come back for more.